What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the most underrated basketball channel on YouTube. Alright, got a brand new ball for you guys and it is a Biden Elite Pro. So how is it? Are there any differences between this one and the old one? Uh, let's just find out. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let me briefly tell you a little bit about the uh, Biden. Biden Sport is based, it's a US company uh, based in South Ken, Washington State. Um, in case you don't know, Washington State is near Canada on the West Coast Pacific Ocean. Uh, Alright, so they, they actually sent me this ball. Uh, to to review it real quick, uh, but they not sponsor me or any type. They just send me the ball. So thank you, Biden. So let's start with the look of the ball. All right, the aesthetic. Um, it pretty much look very similar to the old one. Uh, you know, they got nice golden border with the black um, uh, background. Uh, they got perfection here, and very similar with with the uh, elite, but. I think the old logo is bigger. This one is a little bit smaller because they want to fit in this pro logo in there. Black uh, background and a golden letter on it. Um, and then let's go with the stem or the information. Um, the wall is pretty small. Look, look pretty small. Uh, usually the ball with smaller wall is it's prevent air from leaking. Uh, too much like air leakage, so it won't be too bad. With the bigger wow, you, uh, you know, usually those ball tend to leak air a lot faster. Uh, it say here, uh, official man indoor only. All right, so this ball only for indoor use, guys. Do not use them outside, man. It's you're gonna mess up the ball. The ball is pretty expensive, and you don't want it to use outside. You want an outdoor ball, get the cheaper version, or, you know, actually, uh, Biden got a pretty decent uh, outdoor ball. Um, and then over here, it say moisture needle. Underneath it, it have a BX7E Pro 00. So I guess that's just a serial number. Um, and it say inflated 6 to eight pounds uh, instead of PSI they use pound uh, but usually I like mine at uh, eight PSI but this ball I, I actually pumped it to eight PSI Ooh, that's new so it say Dominican Republic T09 right? BidenSport.com man usually uh, Basketball is neither made in China or Thailand, and now I start to see some ball uh, made in Vietnam. But this ball, this is actually the first time I see it made in the uh, Dominican Republic. Uh, I think the old one is actually made in China. I could be wrong, but I, I can double check for you guys. Um, but yeah, that's that's interesting. So that's I I think maybe because the. Was it the, the supply chain issue? All this COVID, you know, factory kind of shut down briefly, so they they have uh, you know having hard time. Not just Biden, you know, all all the products that make in China having issue producing the ball because, uh, like some of you know, China shut down. Um, uh, their ball, I mean the factories that produce the ball, and then also the the shipping issue, that uh, shipping congestion. I think that's the reason they they uh, move it to Dominican Republic because it's actually uh, it's an island that underneath um, uh, U.S. like.
closer to Florida. And so if there's a supply chain issue, they're able to ship it easily from Dominican to the U.S. Um, but yeah, the grip is good, man. Look, it's pretty easy to grip. Not that, like again, it's, you know, the old one is the same thing. It's the stick, it's grippy, it's really nice. Uh, that is that is why Baden Elite is one of my top choice basketball, top my top pick. Because they, the grip is nice, the bound is good, you know, and the quality, the build quality is it's really nice, man. Um, so I weight this ball already. It is uh, 588 gram. It is a little bit lighter than um, than the, the other balls. Usually, you know, all, all, all the brand is around, you know, 595 gram and up. So anything that lighter than 590, it's usually it's uh, you consider a much lighter ball when you shoot. You actually can feel it when when you shoot. Um, and the circumference of this ball, I I did measure it already. Uh, you know, size seven basketball is supposed to be at uh, 29 and a half inches, but this ball is a little bit short from nine and a half inches but it's not bad just like a couple centimeters off um, and then I like I say I did inflate this ball to uh, 8 psi so all my ball all my basketball that I have you know I think I have close to 50 different indoor basketball now um, I, I inflate them over 8 psi all single one of them so that when I play and stuff or when I weight them or, or even measure them you know I have the ac accurate uh, information all right um, but yeah um, oh let's let me leave the spec for you guys <clears throat> all right so you guys can see if there are any differences um, so yeah by now you should be realized that the spec is look very similar and matter of fact it is the same right same spec from the old one um, uh, there's no differences in terms of material or or you know what they use um, so the question is why did Biden decide to make um, this pro elite pro line. Uh, I think maybe they go through a transition. They um, could be like a pro line for certain conference uh, or certain state, and um, the old the regular elite is for you know different state, different conference too. Um, also, the Elite Pro, probably maybe down the line, you could see them use in like certain college or certain high school, like a, a higher tier uh, basketball, higher tier uh, basketball conferences, right? So, but, you know, that that's the only way that makes sense to me. Um, there's no other reason that they they make the the new line, you know, because maybe um, they get a new certification from different state, different conference, and and then those state those conferences they they want uh, a brand new line just specifically for their uh, their basketball uh, teams. Um, but that's that man um, there's no differences it's the same ball and so the question is should you buy this uh, elite pro or the old elite or the previous elite uh, I think it's up to you if if you want the newest it's um, the elite pro is w way to go 
and the price on this one is a little bit higher uh, 70 74.99 so 75 dollars and the old one is 69.99 so about five dollar different uh, not much but again if if you you know you want the latest this one if you want to save some money go with the old one and you know you can't go wrong with Biden Elite, right? Biden have a bunch of, you can see in the back, a bunch of uh, indoor line and the Elite is the top one because I like the quality, I like the bounce, I like the feel of it. Uh, matter of fact, I would prefer this over the most popular basketball in the U.S., the Wilson Evolution. Um, because uh, I don't know, I just like the feel of how this, how, I like the grip, how the ball feel and the quality of the ball. But yeah, if, if you guys have any question, man, just let me know in the comment below. I, I'll be more than happy to answer for you. Um, catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe if you want to. You should subscribe though because I have more new basketball from different companies. Um, I already post some on my community section, so check that out. Check it out. Um, uh, like if you like, you don't like it, whatever. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Yeah.